So I told my brother that we would train at 9. It's 9.06. <laughs> I'm on my way though. That's all that matters. Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Samantha Wicks and I am currently 13 and a half weeks out from my pro bodybuilding debut that so we actually said that we'd meet like between 9 and 9.30, but I could tell my brother like wanted the 9 o'clock, not the 9.30. Anyway, I said 9.30 because I knew what my morning was going to be like, and here we are. I'm going to train shoulders with Matt. Um, I haven't trained with him in a while, so I'm kind of scared. Whenever I train with Matt, he's always just 10 times stronger, 10 times bigger um, than the last time I trained with him, so God knows what he's like now. But he pushes me, so it's always a good session. Little prep update though, while I am on the way to the gym. So... <laughs> Basically, um, I was feeling like dog shit. The last time I spoke to you guys, I had just had a refeed. Um, and then I went back on the low calories. Look, it just wasn't a vibe. So I had another refeed towards the end of last week. And my body responded really well. So we just decided to increase my baseline calories to 2,000. And ever since then, I have felt so much better i feel more like myself i feel more energized i feel like my recovery is a lot better in my training as well i've also been getting leaner over this time as well so everything is pointing in the right direction um yeah i'm just gonna chill here for a bit steps have also been dropped to eight thousand a day like bro i'm not doing any cardio i don't tend to add in cardio until 10-ish weeks out like around that point my weight though still has not dropped it has been four weeks now and my weight has just maintained at 70 kilos. Yes, it is frustrating because it's like, what the hell, why aren't you dropping? But on the other side of it, I'm not too worried about it, like at all, even in the slightest, like it's just not even a worry of mine. I'm not worried because I'm visually a lot leaner than what I was four weeks ago. It's also kind of cool because this is the leanest I have ever been at 70 kilos. My ab veins have started to show a little bit as well. So that usually doesn't come out until about seven to six weeks out. So. The fact that I'm showing these types of signs at 70 kilos this far out, that is really, really exciting for me. This is the thing when it comes to prep, right? Like you can't be so fixated on a number because the number doesn't dictate anything. Yes, of course you can use it as some form of data. Don't get me wrong, like I definitely use it as data with my clients, um, but it's not like the end all gospel data. Especially when you're a female, man, like my period is due any day now. So obviously my weight is going to be a little bit higher than usual. Um, so yeah, just got to be logical. That's just how it is. We have just announced our group classes for my posing gals. So that is for FMG, ICN and IFBB. We will be holding them at the studio. Everything is on the Wixfit Instagram page. So go check it out. Go see if you can come to any of our group classes. We do have memberships available or you can come for a casual session, but these sessions are great for in season, off season, beginners, season competitors. It's just great to be a part of a community, but then also to ensure that your posing is perfect for stage. And yeah, just meet like-minded people. I love group posing classes. We ran them for the first time last season. And honestly, I genuinely believe that that was the difference between the girls who came and the girls who didn't because they all had experience and they knew exactly what to expect on the day. But then also they've all become like this little friendship group and it's really, really cute. I love anyway, it. Anyway, I'm going to go train now. So um, yeah, enjoy me. Probably going to be in pain, but you know what? It's fine. It's... <laughs> Fine. Hello. Hello, guys. Welcome back to the vlog. Welcome back. <laughs> that was my one appearance per three years. Are you ready, kid? No, I'm not ready. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'll try my best. <laughs> kind of listen to nightclub music, so this is going to be fun. <laughs> nice. Now we're going to go into some lateral raises. Um, this is something that I see commonly done wrong. So we're going to think about rotating our elbow up and leading with your pinky. That's probably the best way that I think about it. That's going to hit your delt. Happy days. Laterals into front raises. Cooked. Woo! Oh wow. 
A lot taller than you are. Yeah, you're a lot taller than me. Remember the days when you were like up to my hip? I'm dying. Shoulders done. Whew. That was a really good session actually. My periods do. And you can so totally tell. Like look at that inflammation at the bottom. It's so cool. Amazing. Babe, we got Nexus. They are so quick with their deliveries. Literally ordered this yesterday. We got our monthly Nexus package and it is actually full to the brim. Got Tropical Crush for your greens. That sounds yummy. Mango lychee for Obliterex, that's for me. I have that every morning just for like my caffeine hit. Grape explosion in aminos, I have that during my workout. We got two pre-workouts. Lucas and I will fight over which flavor we have. <laughs> Ooh, we got vanilla cola and then we also got the citrus bomb. Yum. Yeah, they sound good, hey. Yeah, beautiful. Yummy. And then we got some Amped for the pump formula as well. This is a non-stim pre-workout. So if you're ever training in the afternoon and you're like a bit um, sensitive to caffeine and stuff, this is the one that I would recommend. This one is in the Sherbet Twister. That one's actually really yummy. I've had that before. Protein. We are going through protein so quickly here. We got it in the chocolate and the vanilla. Um, on that note, I am lactose and these seem to sit in my gut fine. I don't have any issues with them. They have just launched a... I just came a little flyer. <laughs> they have just launched their plant protein range. I haven't tried any of it yet um, just because I haven't really needed to, like being lactose and, you know, this whey protein is fine. So I haven't really felt the need to try it. But I'm open to trying it. I might try it next week month we'll see <sighs> i am so tired now that workout was really really good um i love shoulders like it's probably one of my favorite days we have recently changed up my shoulder day so i'm loving it i'm loving up the change up it's still like similar to what i was doing before there's just like a couple of exercises that we're doing differently or just like a different order. to be honest i don't really like changing my workout plans very often you should only really need to change your program every 10 weeks six absolute minimum but really i say 10 because you want to be able to give yourself enough time to actually progress in the workout that you have set yourself and then also progress with form technique all of those things i always find when i get a new program like the first one to three weeks like they're not 100 percent because i'm a finding my way around the workout b trying to figure out the form right c trying to figure out you know what weight i'm supposed to be lifting like it's about three weeks of me trying to figure stuff out so i always like to do 10 weeks minimum of a workout plan just so i actually give myself a good chance but in saying that i have been on the same workout plan for three three months now four months now um and i'm fine with it like i really don't want to change my program because i'm progressing and also my physique is obviously progressing as well so why change it? Anyway, that's my little rant for the day. Another day where I have just forgotten to finish the vlog. I was editing and I was like, mm, there's no ending. But just quickly, my sponsor, Nexus. Ah, love them. Um, they are actually having an end of financial year sale currently. Everything, it's 50% off. Now, my discount code won't give you a further discount. However, it does help me out a lot. So please use my code at the checkout when you are purchasing. My discount code will be working again once the sale is over. So you will be back to your 15% off then. But guys, jump on the 50% off while you can. One thing I do want to say, you don't have to have the supplements to get results. If you have great nutrition and great training and you're taking care of your recovery, you're sleeping well, all those things, you know, supplements are only going to help enhance that. They're not going to be the end all. Like if you have a shit diet, this isn't going to help you. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. It was a very quick to the point vlog this week. Um, I've got another vlog going at the moment. So <laughs> I've just been so excited to vlog. And I've been vlogging as much as I can when I can. Because I've just been so busy with work. So I've literally had two vlogs going for this week. And it's just been very confusing. But it's fine. The next vlog is coming out next week. How good. Like that's great news, right? Anyway, I hope you guys have had a great day whenever you're watching this. And I will talk to you soon.